all about the Lions Park Annual Fiddle Contest being held Sunday, September 15th from 12 to 6 p.m. here in the Lions Community Park in Lions, Pennsylvania. The rain date is September 22nd. This year's program proves to be even bigger and better than last year's event. In spite of last year's 90 degree temperature, more than 20 contestants competed and many more just fiddled around. The age of the contestants last year ranged from 10 to 93 and came from as far away as York and Pittsburgh. The contestants will compete for beautiful handmade fiddle plaques and participant awards, and the rules are very simple. Each contestant must play at least two songs with a maximum of three in a six minute time limit. Any type or style is allowed in this open competition and contestants may use their own backup musicians or they will be provided if needed. However, the Orange Blossom Special will not be permitted to be played in the contest. Anyone interested in competing or just desiring more information can call area code 215-682-6103. There will be many other acts, groups, and individual performances, including square dancing, jigging, banjo, and accordion music for foot stomping, hand clapping fun. There's plenty of free parking and food available. Spectators are asked to bring their own chairs. Remember, that's Sunday, September 15th, 12 to 6 p.m. at the Lyons Community Park, located in Lyons, three miles south of Kutztown. Now, here are some scenes of last year's participants. This uh, contest is a young lady named Tandy Kuberman. So if Tandy will come out on the stage, uh, Tandy comes from Reading. She's a soloist in the Westchester State College Suzuki program. And uh, she's played a bunch of different different places already. As you can see, she's a young lady. And uh, about a nice hand for Tandy Kuberman.
somebody else in here. Instead of being sixth, we're moving him up to third here. You'll see why. His name is Jacob Miller. Everybody calls him Happy Jake. He's 91 years old. His occupation is retired, it says here. He's been playing fiddle for about 80 years. It's longer than I've been playing it. He's been spending a lot of time at home today tuning up his fiddle. He likes uh, it to be just perfect. And uh, he has some of his music on tape in the Congressional Library of Congress. If you've ever gone to the Library of Congress, stop by and uh, ask him to listen to some of Pappy Jake's music. So <clears throat> he's an official contestant, but we're going to play, going to get him on third. Can't take too much of this heat. All the way from Portland, Pennsylvania. Four miles south of the Delaware water can. So he's come a long way.
Larry's been playing fiddle for about nine years. His fiddles are on a lot at home, I've been told. Watch when you take that picture. He plays with Far From The City. So he'll be playing here after he finishes here in the contest also. All the way from Landis Store, if you know where that is. How about now saying for Dave Miller. All you musicologists out there, it's... This is called The Hangman's Reel, and uh, as the story goes on this, uh, if you were sentenced to be hung, you had to learn this tune real fast and play it, and if you could play it without any mistakes, you were acquitted of your crimes, and therefore not hung. I'll see how well I do here.